Hi, I'm Teniola Shobowale. Here's your Channel TV Evening News recap for December the 30th, 2019. The federal government has put the total public debt stock of the nation at $83 billion. According to the Minister of Information and Culture, Mr. Lai Mohammed, the country's debt stock was misrepresented by those he described as scaremongers. He, however, noted that the debt was accumulated over the years by successive governments. President Mohamedou Buhari has received security briefing from the nation's service chiefs in Abuja. The service chiefs were led to the meeting by the Minister of Defence, Major General Bashir Magashi. Present at the meeting were the Chief of Defence Staff, Chief of Air Staff and the Chief of Naval Staff, among others. However, the Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Takur Burutai, was absent, but a senior official of the Nigerian Army sat in his place. The Nigerian military will be withdrawing troops from some parts of the country. The Chief of Naval Staff, speaking on Monday in Abuja, explained that the withdrawal was to enable civil authorities to take over the duties of ensuring the security of lives and property in such places. On the international scene, a Croatian court has sentenced former Prime Minister Ivo Sanuda to six years in jail. He was sentenced alongside the boss of Hungary's MOL Energy Group. Sanada, who is already serving time for a separate graft conviction, and the CEO of the MOL Group were convicted for receiving and giving a bribe concerning a 2009 deal after the Hungarian firm purchased shares in local oil and gas group INA. Syria Club Roma have confirmed negotiations with US billionaire Dan Fredkin to buy the Italian club. According to the club, the negotiations are related to a potential transaction involving Neep Roma, holding Spa and its subsidiaries, including AS Roma. And that's the evening news recap. Don't forget to join us tomorrow for the morning news update. I'm Teniola Shobowale. Thank you for watching.